This is the Weird Walking Meditation from Cycle 6 of The Noble Art. Weird is the Anglo-Saxon term to describe the essential pattern that underlies the fabric of reality and existence as we know it. It's very similar to other terms that show up in other cultures, maybe with some slight differences, but carrying a sense of the essential meaning to the Chinese, to the Tao, the path or the way. It's similar to the hermetic concept of the all, the one mind that gives rise to the one thing that is inherent in all things. It is this that the alchemical text, the Emerald Tablet, is describing, even going so far as to say that it is illuminating the pattern or the way. Weird is the flow of the universe, the movement of becoming, of being, deconstructing and becoming once more. It is not our role in this existence to try to understand the weird. It is far beyond our scope to be able to grasp. Nor is it our role to try to contain or control it because that is quite simply impossible. For one, we are not separate from it. I can no more control the Tao than I can stop the flow of my joy when I see a puppy. But I can choose how I respond to it. This meditation, this weird walking meditation, invites you to see the patterns of your own life through the expansive lens of the weird. And in doing so, brings a greater understanding to your life's experience and a greater clarity to your life's purpose. If you have done the previous meditations in the Noble Art, you will find yourself once more in a familiar landscape and we will pick up the journey where we left it off in cycle five. If you have not done the previous meditations, just close your eyes to focus on your breath and open yourself to the adventure of a new journey. The heat of the noonday sun has given way to the gentle warmth of late afternoon. Its amber light casts a soft glow over the landscape. Everything is touched with a golden tinge. In your journey, you have traveled long. You have traveled far. You have endured trials. You have encountered wonders. And now a path lies before you, leading you up to further untold wonders. A path that leads you as close to the stars as you can get while still having feet on this earth. You look at the path ahead and know you now have a lightness in your being that will bring ease to your climb. The release of challenges and fear at the world tree and the gift of your prayer bundle blessing to the divine have created a beautiful clarity of sight. You are fully in this moment. You are fully present in the weird. And 
And as you begin to trek up the mountain path, reaching for the stars in every step, you have truly become a weird walker in every sense. As you climb the path, pay attention to the landscape around you. How the flora changes the higher you go. The patterns that are discernible both in the stones beneath your feet and the clouds above your head. You become acutely aware that the entirety of your experience is talking to you. So long as you attune your ears to hear. You become acutely aware that the fullness of your life experiences have always been talking to you. Though you may not have always heeded the message. As you come closer and closer to the summit of this particular mountain peak, you become even more attuned to discerning the underlying patterns present all around you. In the rarefied high altitude air, you can see so clearly. All of nature gives up a vision of fractals, as if there is tangible structure under the patterns you see, and patterns emanating from the structure. You can go deeper within or pull further out and yet the patterns persist. With your inner eye you see that same fractal vibration in your own life. You know your path, your purpose, your gift. And you know you have always been vibrating to the resonance of that energy. You see with absolute clarity all the times you have walked your path with sure steps. You know well the times you strayed, knowing now that there was valuable information that came to you, even in those times. There have been good times and challenging times. There have been times of despair and times of joy. There have been times of comfort and times of trial. The vibration has maintained, even if the amplitude may have changed greatly at times. But everything has always unfolded exactly as it needed to. You can see that now. The weird is woven into every moment and underpins everything. With this realization, you know what it is to be anchored in your own vision of self. Just as you crest the peak and step on to the elevated plateau that opens the world to your eyes and opens your eyes to that golden seed of self 
that you thought had burned with your prayer bundle. But here it is, at your feet, glowing softly in the light that is getting lower still in the sky. You pick it up and cradle it tenderly in your cupped hand. A part of you is so happy to hold it once more. A part of you knows it never left you. Another part knows that whether you hold the seed or not, it is always with you. And that, that is also weird. You are weird. Smiling softly, you look out over the expanse that lies before you and below you, taking in the scene. There below you, you see the world tree. There far below you, you see the timeless river. And there, across from you, but so far away, you see the cave, the place this all began so, so long ago. You appreciate how far you've come, how much you have learned, and how much wisdom you have attained. You know this journey has changed forever and always how you see your life. You breathe into that. Allowing that breath to move through your body. Allowing that awareness to move through your body. And when you are ready, take three deep Centering breaths, allowing each breath to bring you slowly, surely back to the here and now, back to the place where you sit. And when you're ready, open up your eyes.